I made a video on this custom room called Omni Room some time ago about uh, one of the unique custom rooms out there based on Android 12. That time I only had some screenshots, but now we have installed it on Redmi Note 10 Pro. If you're a user of this device, you can install this thing. Maybe it's available for some other devices also. Let's just talk about this. The version which we are using here right now is of course Android 12 with the February security patch, the latest version which I am using in this one. This Omni Room is something different actually with some new different things. Monet theming is of course not there but something different is there which I am going to talk about in this video so stay tuned and let's find out some things. Let's just take a look at the default things first of all. It doesn't contain any kind of pixel launcher or launcher launcher pre-installed but you have the option to customize for example you have the option to add the search widget. You also have the option to change the grid sizes which you get in pixel launcher and launcher launcher 2. You have the option to customize the icon shapes etc. A lot of things are available in the form of customizations which you don't get in the settings app. The things is when I when I installed this room for the first time I saw then did that there's no customizations at all but it contains some customizations which i'm gonna share with you i think so but yes it's fully aosp even you have the google apps installed in this version but one of the best thing is the size is still less than 1 gb that's quite impressive and you can see the quick settings panel is also customizable i've customized enable the option to hide the labels so yes that option is working perfectly fine the room is absolutely looking something different for you. Maybe you should try out. If you're Redmi Note 10 Pro or Pro Max user, this contains this camera called a snap camera, which of course does not make any kind of sense. And I don't think so most of the users will use this. So yes, you have the option to use the Gcam modes, etc. A lot of Gcam videos are already available on my channel. Make sure to check out those. If we move on to the settings section, as I just said previously, that it doesn't does not contain any kind of features in the settings app. If you move on to the settings option, if you move on to the display section, you have almost same kind of things which you get in the stock Android 12 or stock Android 12 custom rooms, etc. The wallpaper does not contain any kind of monitor theming or support for you. Security sector has same kind of things, notifications, etc. Everything is almost same. There are no major customization, even not minor customizations available in the settings app, but it contains some features which I will show you later on. So stay tuned and don't miss the video. We have the device specific things, of course, included. If you're a user of this device, you can customize these things if you want to, of course. This is where we have some customizations or features present called Omni Roam Control Center available as an Android app. So if you'll be able to see, you can get that. You have the option of weather and etc, etc, etc. System updates. It has the OTA updates option available for you. You can see I'm using the Google Apps build and the size is less than 1 GB. That is absolutely great. No room I found so far contains Google Apps but has less than 1 GB. This is great. You have some local wallpapers like four wallpapers pre installed but including that if you select the remote option which will download some online wallpapers on a device and you can apply any one of those if you like these wallpapers for example we have this omni without limits wallpaper like this one for example i want to apply this uh, let me show you one thing if you're able to see the the things how this is applying it will remind you of old days android 4 5 or something like that you know little bit little bit old unique ui yes quick settings customizations you can see the columns the citra brightness slider if you don't want that you can disable that option it's up to you including that you can hide the labels columns etc you can customize here comes a kind of monitor theming where you can adjust the colors as you can see the screen or background colors have been changed but it does not support monitor theming so keep this thing in mind it does not support monitor the monitor theming you can customize the colors according to your own preference the black blue red whatever you want to choose including that some icon shape customization are also included in this one this looks quite good i think so but let's see if we have something other things it's almost same bars etc 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 a lot of customizations based options available here are some things i've already shown you if you want to install this build you can install from custom recovery and you're good to go very simple things this is all from today's short and simple video if you like this video don't forget to like and share this i'll see you in the next video goodbye Like I'm floating through the air